Hello everyone, my name is Andrew Lynham and I'm the head boy here in Gormanson College. It's a great honour to be speaking to you today. As head boy, I get to represent the school and communicate with you and a lot of the younger students. I've been attending this school for six years now and I've made many great memories that will stick with me for the rest of my life. This year has been a very strange year for all of us. However, we have overcome every obstacle COVID has thrown at us. The teaching staff here are very good at what they do and I'm confident that I'll do very well in my leaving cert because of them. I plan to study architecture after school. Thanks to transition year, I have plenty of time and opportunities to think about what I'll do after school. I really love this school and I'm very proud to be attending here. That's all from me. Thank you for your time. Welcome to Franciscan College Gormanson. My name is Misola and I'm the head girl. I feel honoured to be talking to you today. Although we're gathered in peculiar conditions, I am thrilled to be able to connect with you through the internet and inform you about our lively school here. I've been in Franciscan College Gormanson for five years now, which has been incredibly nurturing, warm, vibrant and transformative. Franciscan College Gormanson has been a great haven of transition for me and I have um, established great friendships that are indispensable and life-changing. I have a great rapport with the teachers in the school, which has not only been incredibly educational, but extremely lively and encouraging. It is an undeniably spending environment that has allowed me to flourish, and I am beyond happy to finish sixth year and be the best that I can be. Hello, my name is Sophie Barry. I am a fifth year student here in Gormanson College. Hi, my name is Kendi Deer and I'm a fifth year student in Gormanson College as well. Do you hold a leadership position in our school currently? I don't, but I would like to go for one in sixth year as I think it's a nice way to tie in our school's community and helps us all get closer together. What do you think is the most important thing you can learn in school? I think the most important thing you can learn is not to be too phased by the academic side. Obviously it is important, but to keep a good group around yourself and focus on like your mindset and everything else around you more. Yeah. Hi, my name's Anna Ledwith and I'm a fifth year student. Hi, my name's Leah Kelly and I'm a fifth year student. How would you describe yourself? I'd describe myself as a very chatty, bubbly person. How would you describe your school? I'd describe my school as an old treasure place. The teachers are very caring and trustworthy. What subject do you enjoy the most and why? My favourite subject would be art. Um, I really enjoy the creative side to art. Do you hold a, leader, a leadership position at your school currently? No, I don't. Would you like to hold a leadership position? Yeah, I'd like to be a clan prefect for my clan park. What do you think is the most important thing you can learn in school? The most important thing I think you can learn in school is life skills. What do you think about Gormiston and what are your three favourite things about the school of Dillon? Um, three favourite things at the moment would have to be during the pandemic. It would definitely be having a lot of open space outdoors to walk around and roam. And definitely socialising with your friends again because that was like, it was, there was a long period of time where you couldn't obviously talk to your friends and stuff. And it was difficult. Um, and then another one would have to be the PE facility um, and playing uh, sports for the school. So, yeah, Daniel, what's it? Um, well, first of all, one thing I love about the school is the amazing music room we have. Um, yeah. For me as a musician, I love having a little safe space I can come into, can study, can mess around with guitars and learn more. That really um, means a lot to me. As well as that, I like the general atmosphere with students. I mean, we're all mates here, you know, we have a good banter every lunchtime and it really, you know, helps me get through the day. As well, I find the staff enormously friendly and really helpful most of the time. What about you, Warren? I think a lot of things I agree with, the open area, it's very helpful. Um, also, socialising with you guys helps me get through the day, the break and the lunch, and then also the facilities we have there. We get to chill around in our own table, make our noise, have our fun, have our lunch. Seems good. Well, if there's one thing you could change about school, what would it be? Um, I personally think more practical work like woodwork, metal work, uh, home economics and stuff like that. So, um, yeah, more practical work. Daniel? I'd have to agree with you there. Um, obviously we're a smaller school, but it would be nice to have more subjects as well. I think a water fountain would uh, be a good oh, yeah. addition to the school. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe not now during the pandemic, but at some point. Uh, what about you, Owen? I think 
definitely the same. Definitely a lot of maybe home, home economics or metalwork or woodwork, as Dylan mentioned, and maybe yeah, just a broader choice of subjects overall. I think that's, that's good. Hi, I'm Genevieve Carroll, and I'm a fifth year student at Gormson College. Hi, I'm Katie Enor, and I'm a fifth year student at Gormson College. Um, what was your most favourite subject and why? Uh, at the minute, I really like ag agricultural science, um, mainly because I do geography as well, and they link in together, and I have a lot of interest in sustainability and the environment. Do you hold a leadership role at this school currently? Uh, no, I don't. Would you like to? Um, yeah, particularly I'd like to be um, clan prefect for Clan Project next year. What do you think is the most important thing to learn in school? Um, aside from the academics and working hard on your exams and everything, I think um, I've learned a lot about the importance of friendship and kindness and looking after yourself and others. Hi, I'm Abigail Redden and I'm a fifth year student. Hi, my name is Sarah Jane and I'm a fifth year student. So what subjects do you like the most and why? Um, I think my favourite subjects would have to be like maths and science because I'm definitely like a logical kind of person and I really like problem solving. And do you hold a leadership role in the school? Yes, I'm actually currently on the Student Council and the Green Schools Committee and I plan on keeping those roles going through fifth and sixth year. Good morning and welcome to Franciscan College Gormanston. Behind me on the steps of our college you will see a selection of our first year students and a number of our sixth year prefects. In a moment, our prefects are going to interview our first year students about their experiences of school so far, having completed three weeks of their post-primary education and most importantly, their time spent being educated here in Gormanston. You will also notice that they are wearing casual clothes because they are timetabled for PE. So I invite you to step inside our school building as we listen to our prefects interview our first years about what life is like for them during the first three weeks of their school career here in Gormanston and their hopes and dreams for the future. Thank you. Uh, what's your favourite thing about your new school? Probably going to your locker because it's fun to organise it and have your things your own way. So how different is primary school compared to secondary school? Well, in primary school when you're in sixth class you're the oldest and then when you go into secondary school it's just really crazy because you're like the youngest. What's the most exciting thing you've learned in secondary school so far? Probably when our science teacher showed us how to use the Bunsen burners because it was really enjoyable. So uh, what are you looking forward to for this school year? I'm looking forward to making new friends and learning something new. So what do you know about our clan system in the school? Well, I know that you get points for things that you do good and that clan work the best. Name the three best things about your school. Um, the space, the teachers that we have and the work that we do. What is the biggest difference between primary school and secondary school? Well, in primary school we felt like we were really mature and we were the oldest, but now that we're in secondary school we're like the youngest now. What is the one thing you would change about our school and why? Um, I'd probably change wearing masks because it gets a bit annoying and also being able to move around because it gets like really warm in the one classroom the whole time. This is the biology lab. Yeah. Welcome to the outdoor area. This is where the junior students spend their break time. Lots of open space uh, provided the challenges that we're going through through this pandemic. Lots of open space for students to uh, enjoy their break time here. This is the bell area as well where students come to eat at lunchtime. And we're going upstairs to show the new classrooms that have just been built. So here we have the new classrooms that have just been built. Due to the COVID circumstances, uh, we had to build new classrooms, but we have many classrooms that have just been built. Okay, our school took the initiative. This used to be a study hall for the students to sit in, but to tackle the public uh, health and safety guidelines, 
they create classrooms to open space for the other classes. I'll show you them off right now. Welcome to the Gorman St. College Math Corridor. This is all the math classrooms within the school. This is the um, this is the basement um, where we have classrooms and the canteen as well. Uh, this is our geography classroom. This is the new first year classrooms, safe environment. There used to be a library here, but we to, uh, tackled the public health and safety guidelines to create it into a classroom, a safe space for students to learn. Uh, welcome to the Gormanson College Canteen. Uh, this ca canteen has been modified, so it's possible to keep social distancing and get food at the same time, as you can see. This is one of our Chalk Francis classrooms and over here we have our sensory room. Um, this here is our new art room. Thank you for visiting Cormus the College. We hope to see you soon. See, you lot have put me off. <laughs> I was doing this last week and I had no problems.